Welcome to the Rare History Channel. 15 Facts About One of the Most Famous Mobsters in American History Mickey Cohen was a notorious figure in the criminal underworld of Los Angeles in the mid-20th century. He was involved in a wide range of illegal activities, from gambling and prostitution to drug trafficking and the protection racket. Cohen was a flamboyant and charismatic individual who lived a colorful life filled with violence and danger. In this video, we will explore 15 shocking facts about Mickey Cohen. Fact number 1. Early Life Mickey Cohen's early life began on September 4, 1913, in Brooklyn, New York, where he was born as Meyer Harris Cohen. He was raised in an Orthodox Jewish family and was the youngest of four siblings. Cohen's family struggled financially, and he had to work odd jobs from a young age to help make ends meet. His early life was marked by poverty and hardship, which would later shape his criminal career. Number 2. Boxer. Cohen was a talented boxer in his youth and competed in amateur matches. He won several local titles and was known for his aggressive fighting style. Boxing became a passion for Cohen, and he continued to train and fight throughout his life. However, he soon realized that his true calling lay in the criminal underworld, and he began to pursue a life of crime. Number 3. Moved to Los Angeles. In 1939, Cohen moved to Los Angeles to pursue his criminal career. He was attracted to the city's burgeoning underworld and saw opportunities for wealth and power. He quickly became involved in the city's criminal networks, working for gangster Bugsy Siegel. Cohen's rise to power was rapid, and he soon established himself as one of the most notorious figures in the Los Angeles underworld. Number 4. Protection Racket Cohen was a master of the protection racket, which involved extorting money from businesses in exchange for protection from other criminal gangs. He was particularly successful in this line of work and soon became one of the most powerful men in the Los Angeles underworld. Cohen's protection racket allowed him to amass a fortune and build a vast criminal empire. Number 5. Connection to Hollywood. Cohen had numerous connections to Hollywood celebrities and was often seen at high-profile events. He was particularly close to actor and singer Frank Sinatra, whom he considered a friend. Cohen's association with Hollywood gave him a certain level of notoriety and added to his mystique as a criminal figure. He was also known to have romantic relationships with several Hollywood actresses. Number 6. Convicted of Tax Evasion In 1951, Cohen was convicted of tax evasion and sentenced to three years in federal prison. He had been under investigation by the IRS for several years, and the evidence against him was overwhelming. Cohen was sent to Alcatraz, the infamous federal prison on an island off the coast of San Francisco. He served his time there until he was released in 1954. Number 7. Assassination Attempt In 1949, Cohen survived an assassination attempt when a bomb was placed in a restaurant he was dining at in Hollywood. The bomb failed to detonate, and Cohen escaped unharmed. The attempted assassination was believed to be the work of a rival gang, and it marked a turning point in the Los Angeles underworld's violent history. Cohen became more paranoid and began to take extra precautions to protect himself from future attacks. Number 8. Loyal to Jewish Heritage Despite his criminal activities, Cohen was proud of his Jewish heritage and often used it to his advantage in his criminal dealings. He was known for his support of Jewish charities and causes and saw himself as a defender of the Jewish community. Cohen's Jewish identity was a source of pride for him and gave him a sense of purpose and identity. Number 9. Involved in Drug Trafficking Cohen was involved in drug trafficking and was known to import large quantities of heroin and cocaine from overseas. He was also known to distribute drugs to members of his own gang. Cohen's involvement in drug trafficking allowed him to increase his wealth and expand his criminal empire. However, it also put him at risk of prosecution by law enforcement authorities. 
Number 10. Escaped Death on Multiple Occasions. Throughout his criminal career, Cohen survived several attempts on his life. He was a master of self-preservation and was constantly on guard, taking precautions to protect himself from potential threats. In addition to the assassination attempt in 1949, Cohen survived numerous other attacks, including shootings and bombings. His ability to evade death and continue his criminal activities only added to his reputation as a powerful and feared figure in the Los Angeles underworld. Number 11. Violent Temper. Cohen had a notorious temper and was known for his violent outbursts. He would often resort to physical violence to assert his authority over his criminal empire and to intimidate others. Cohen's violent behavior was a reflection of his upbringing in a rough and impoverished neighborhood in Brooklyn, where violence was a way of life. Number 12. Friendship with Police Officers. Despite his criminal activities, Cohen was known to have several close friendships with police officers. He would often pay them off or offer them bribes in exchange for protection and information about law enforcement operations. This relationship with the police allowed Cohen to operate his criminal empire with impunity and avoid prosecution for many years. Number 13. Betrayed by Associates. In the 1950s, several of Cohen's top associates turned against him and provided evidence to law enforcement authorities. This led to Cohen's eventual conviction for tax evasion and the decline of his criminal empire. The betrayal of his closest associates was a devastating blow to Cohen, who had trusted them implicitly and believed they were loyal to him. Number 14. Death and Legacy. Cohen died on July 29, 1976, at the age of 62 from stomach cancer. His death marked the end of an era in the Los Angeles underworld and the decline of organized crime in the city. Despite his criminal activities, Cohen remains a legendary figure in the history of organized crime and is remembered for his ruthlessness and charisma. Number 15. Depicted in popular culture. Cohen has been the subject of numerous books, films, and television shows, which have romanticized his life and criminal activities. Some of the most notable portrayals of Cohen include the character of Johnny O'Clock in the film of the same name and the character of Ben Bugsy Siegel in the film Bugsy. These depictions of Cohen have added to his mystique and ensured that he remains a compelling and controversial figure in popular culture.